Uh, what's going on, Brody? So, um, yeah, I got a whole bunch of new clothes once again, bro. If you're new here, Dante buys a whole bunch of new clothes. I make these videos very often because I waste a lot of money on new clothes. I don't know why. Yeah, at least we still fly, so you feel me? That's all that matters. But with that being said, man, I'm finna show you all my new pickups that I recently got. And I'm gonna show you a whole bunch of places you can shop at, you feel me? Get some fly shit. Oh, so, sit back, relax, and we finna get into the video. Where should we start? Shoes. I only got two new pairs of shoes. The first shoe are these Playoff Ace right here. They are the 2023 ones. They are the newest ones. I had these for a minute now. I had these for a few months. I just forgot to show y'all these in my last pickup video. So I'm showing y'all these now. Very, very slept on Jordan model. Not gonna lie, Playoff Ace are fucking beautiful, bro. And the last shoes I got, I don't even know. Are these shoes? These are loafers. But yeah, we got the Tods right here. I call these the Tods. But I did have to grab some loafers. I picked these up at Eco Thrift near me, probably for like $7. Yeah, bro, I don't know. I'm just trying to be versatile with my style, you feel me? I'm still trying to find my style. I wanted to try it out. I have not tried it out yet, bro. I haven't put these on my feet, not once. They gonna get worn. I don't know when, someday. Now I'm finna get into my accessories. I only got a few accessories. And then everything else is literally closed, so. All right, y'all, for the very first accessory, man, as you can see, we got these beautiful grills right here. If y'all didn't know, I do have um, a 14 karat gold set. We did get Tritone, had to go a little crazy. Shout out to my people at Ice Giant, man. They threw me these, which is absolutely crazy, and the quality is crazy. I be doing too much, I'm a little extra. That's why I got Tritone. But these next two accessories are just these glasses right here. Now, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Am I brain rotted? Like, am I a bot? Bro, I'll be shopping on TikTok shop, bro. I bought a few things, bro. I bought Pokemon cards off of there. And yes, they were real. I bought a whole bunch of shit off there, bro. They be having deals. I don't care what y'all say, bro. If you're not shopping on TikTok shop, bro, what are you doing? It's good accessories to have, and I actually do have prescribed glasses. I am blind as hell. My vision is probably about a 2 out of 20. Can't see for shit. These ones aren't prescribed, you feel me? They just a little calm, a little sexy. See, like, look, nigga look good as hell. I look sexy. You can't even lie, bro. If you say I don't look sexy, what are you talking? Uh, nerdy glasses right here, good accessory. The uh, clear ones as well, you feel me? Just nice to throw on with the fit. Um, I definitely think just little details like this enhance the fit. Even if you don't wear real glasses, bro, get, get, some, get some glasses, bro. You're gonna be fly as hell. Then, the final accessory. Oh, shit, my bad. I got this big ass green army duffel backpack right here. As you can see, this shit is absolutely ginormous. I was gonna use this for a campaign for my clothing brand, Barry Doubt, but I did not end up using it. Now I just got this big fat ass bag. Shit literally can probably hold a body inside of it. Probably like 20 bucks. Nice vintage army bag, you feel me? Calm shit. Now I'm finna get into the clothing items. First, I'm finna go with the brands that send me shit. You know what I'm saying? I gotta show them love. And then we're gonna get into like vintage pickups like that I got from the thrift store and shit. I'm finna go on order, but this first item that a brand sent me, man. Shout out to my brothers at Peace of Mind. Send me out this beautiful, beautiful like utility zip up right here with this stone, this black wash, stone wash. And as you can see on the pockets, it got like distress stitching and got like these cargo pockets on the side. You know what I'm saying? You could throw a little eighth in there, you feel me? Or if you do any type of other substances, you could throw that shit nearest to i don't know don't do drugs kids but uh also got this like titty logo right here that say sop and they got this peace of mind right here uh embroidered onto the hoodie beautiful zip up appreciate y'all since we did a zip up i'm gonna go with my next zip up shout out to my dogs at dimmick new jersey it's like dimmick's nj y'all gonna see the ad they threw me this crazy ass like freaky deaky triple zip zip up right here this shit is beautiful all zip ups are mobile too or like they all work if you tapped in with the anime Tokyo Ghoul, it gives me like Ken Kaneki vibes. That's what it gives me. If you're not tapped in, get tapped in. But quality is definitely crazy. Really appreciate y'all. Even got like their logo back here. Um, I love when y'all send me quality pieces, you feel me? Because it inspires me and like motivates me to come even harder for all my next drops. Like, cause y'all shit be going crazy. I ain't gonna lie. And if y'all want me to do like rating y'all clothing brands or like if y'all wanna send me shit and rate clothing brands, I don't know. Just let me know. Shit, I don't know. This next piece, my boys at United Archives sent me out this mohair. It's like in this maroon colorway. I think Toy Story 3 or 4. You know, Laszlo, like the little furry bear, the evil ass little bear that tried to backdoor Woody and him and shit. It reminds me of him just because of color. Shit's fire, bro. I ain't gonna lie. It's my first mohair. I put it on. Like, don't get me wrong, the quality crazy, fits crazy. But this motherfucker is itchy as hell. This shit had me itching like a fiend. Like, I think all mohairs are like that, but definitely in the winter time, finish spaz with this. Shout out my brothers at United Archive. Y'all went crazy. Beautiful piece. Uh, this is the last hoodie I got. This is from my dogs at Flow War. 
LA, I believe. Super, super tough washed red hoodie right here. As you can see, it has like this ombre effect where it goes like super dark and then it lightens up. I don't know what the hell my dog barking at, but then on the side of both arms, they got this cursive text. It says flourishing war. I fuck with that. And these are the last three pieces I got sent from clothing brands. I started off with my boys from Space Cadet USA. They always getting me right. They sent me a hoodie like not too long ago. I actually, it was a while ago, but I wear that motherfucker a lot. They sent me this tee right here. So me got a red star and then it got like the blue and yellow like contrast right here. And it got like this varsity, like these varsity lines. I made a little outfit of the day in this and everybody in the comments was calling me a Toy Story ball and shit. Like I thought y'all was funny. Like what the fuck? But kind of deal with like a toy story ball but regardless you feel me still a hard piece definitely a comp t-shirt uh, i love shirts like this the next tee i absolutely love this tee bro um as you can see i got like a stain on there i don't know how to get it out but i wear this shit all the time it's calm graphic right here uh it is from my boys at i think it's still loading onyx i believe it's the last piece that a brand did send me this is from my brothers at unauthorized collective rugby shirt but instead of it being a long sleeve, it's like a short sleeve. And then it got this comp little subtle logo. I don't look purple on the camera, but it's orange and blue. And the quality is good as fuck too. I don't even know what type of fabric this is, but it's like, it's different. It's not like cotton or it might be cotton. I don't know. Before I get into the next pickups, I just want to give a huge shout out to all the brands that send me stuff. Y'all did not have to send me none, but y'all did, man. And I appreciate y'all for that. It's all love. Um, and if you have a brand or a business, some you trying to promote, feel me? DM my Instagram or uh, email me. My business email is in my description as well as my Instagram link. But yeah, appreciate y'all. Next pickups. Now we get into like the final shit. We still got a lot. We got like 10, 12 pieces left. I'm finna get through them. Um, but we're gonna start with the bottoms. And everything else is like thrifted shit. First pair of bottoms. Now I've been looking for a baggy pair of camo like shorts, cargo shorts for a minute. Every time I get some cargo shorts or something, they be fitting stupid. These ones fit perfectly, bro. They're nice natural baggy fit. I caught these at a savers thrift store got these for like seven bucks take a closer look at the little camel print it's like leaves bro i didn't even notice that when i first picked them up it's like it's cool the last two pair of bottoms i got both of these at zara now everybody every time i post a video where the shorts where the shorts i be gatekeeping i ain't gonna lie but first ones this like green wash cargo and they like baggy i believe both of these they were 60 each or 70 each when i seen they had a green pair bro i bought them instantly i could not pass them up because i've been wanting a green pair of cargo shorts or like green shorts in general that are baggy still looking for some like baggy green cargo pants that are like this color but i needed these last pair of shorts are basically the same as those green ones they're just black very tough and the fit is amazing. Got like these details on the pockets as well, like button shit. You know what I'm saying? You got a little extra cheese, go to Zara. I think like 60, 70 bucks. You're not gonna regret it. You feel me? I wear these all the time. Now the rest of this shit is all like tops. All right now for the first one, y'all boys might think this is needles. This is not needles, my brother. This is fleetles, okay? I did make this shit. Um, I saved myself about 350. Now don't get me wrong, needles is tough. Shit, I had a whole bunch of extra flannels. I was like, fuck it, I'm gonna do a video. Oh yeah, I did drop a video. So my recent video before this one, it's gonna be tough as hell for the winter and like the fall, which is coming up, so. This right here, got this at the thrift store, Izod Mustard Yellow Crew Neck. It has like a natural crop to it as well, so like win-win. I'm probably gonna distress it and like sun fade it, as you can see this one. It gives it like an, a nice vibe to it. You feel me, don't look basic and boring. That's one thing from the thrift store, I always pick up no matter like what. If it fit good, if it look good, I'm getting a blank from the thrift store. This next one, I don't got really too much to say about it. It's just a, a Gap Thermal, like long sleeve. It does have like this cum blast on it. I don't know what the fuck that is. It will not come out, but shit, fuck it. Uh, I like wearing thermals or like white long sleeves under my graphic tee. These two graphic tees right here, I got these at the same like consignment shop. It's called Pocket Monkey Vintage, I believe, but me and my boys went in there. First tee, it is this vintage Joe Lewis boxing tee. Can't never go wrong with a little vintage tee. And it got a graphic on the back. It just has all my boys records and shit. And then this last one, I believe is like a radio T because it's a 98.1 FM, pretty sure. The graphic is cool. Um, I like the fit of it, the crop vibe. Nice graphic T, yeah. And these last two are kind of the same style shirt. Um, this motherfucker right here is beautiful. Now I got this in San Francisco at Wasteland. It was $38. I feel like I got waxed a little bit, but like this shit is hard as hell. So I wasn't tripping. Motocross long sleeve right here whole bunch of graphics on it got little side hits back hits like shit is beautiful and i actually dropped my high score bowling game in this against my trash ass friends i scored a 222 
You feel me? I'm like PBA pro, bro. If I start averaging a 200, y'all might see me on TV bowling and shit. And this is the final pickup I'm gonna show y'all, but it is basically the same shit. This one I got at the thrift store. It's a Ore Blades Junior Racing tee. I don't know. This shit don't really fit. So I'm probably gonna sell this on Depop. Ore Blades all over it. And then it got like these side hits with the Ore Blades. But yeah, my brothers, that's gonna be it for today's video. That's gonna be it for the recent pickups. I hope y'all did enjoy this. I'm probably gonna post another one of these probably within the next two to three weeks. Cause like I told y'all in the beginning, I buy shit all the time. If you are at the end of the video, bro, you might as well subscribe, bro. Join DCN. We on the road to 10K. Finna hit that by the end of the year. So that's why I need you to subscribe. I need you to like the video, give me to the algorithm. Yeah, y'all, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. And I will see y'all in the next video. Ski.